Hey guys, in this video we're going to teach you how to add a YouTube video onto your project. Alright guys, before we start, I want to mention that I'm using the Nord VS Code theme. So if you like it, go ahead and check it out. It's absolutely free. All right, the first thing we want to do is select the YouTube video that we want to use in our project. So let's open up our browser and let's go over to YouTube and go ahead and search for whatever you want. I'm going to search for Space Jam 2 and I'm going to go with this video. All right, all you have to do is click on this button here, the share button, and then click embed. And then you're going to click copy to copy all of this. All right, all we have to do is just paste this inside of our project and we get the video. So what if we wanna change the width and height? Well, you have two options. You could either do it through here or you could do it this way, which I actually recommend. So let's cut and paste this in here. And let's change the width to 100%. And we're gonna do the same for the height. All right, let's go into our CSS file and let's get access to the container. And this is where we're going to adjust the width and height. So let's say that we wanted a width of 400 and a height of 225 pixels. Well, we just changed that in here and the video is automatically gonna adjust to that width and height. Please make sure you're always using a 16 to nine aspect ratio. Otherwise the video is gonna look funny. So let's say we wanted to change this to 225 pixels well, that's a perfect square, but you can't see the video in its entirety because this is not in 16 to nine aspect ratio. If you don't know what that is, don't worry about it. I'm going to recommend this website, aspectratiocalculator.com. So just choose a width. Let's say you wanted a width of 500. It gives you the height automatically. So let's go back over here. Let's change this to 500 and this to 281. And as you can see, the video is always going to be perfect. All right. One last thing that I want to mention is you're not going to be able to embed every single video as a YouTube creator. You have the option of either allowing users to embed your videos or not. And believe it or not, a lot of people choose not to allow others to embed their video. So let me show you what this would look like. So I'm going to go back to YouTube and I'm going to search for music. Usually it's the music videos, at least that I've found that do not allow you to embed their videos. So I'm just going to click on this one and I'm going to follow the same process. And I'm just going to paste this into my project. And as you can see, it gives us this message. So if you get this message, that's what it means. The user is not allowing you to embed their video into your project. All right. That's going to be it for this video. Please make sure to hit the like button and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.